Hello and welcome to my Submagic tutorial where I'm going to be showing you how Submagic works. It's actually a very easy process. If you'd like to follow along, I will leave my link down below where you can get started for free. And if you want to upgrade, I will also have my coupon code, which is island. You get a nice little discount. So I've just upgraded and I've played around with it a little. Very easy to use. First thing what we want to do is once we're actually in the main dashboard here, let's go to my projects here and simply click on create. Now all we need to do is click or drag and drop to upload the video here. I'm just going to go upload one that I quickly did. So let's click here in the middle and grab it. So here's the video. Let's say we want to rename it. This is about like, you know, starting from square one. Just give it a title so you know what it's all about. Okay, so we have our language here. I'm going to go with English, but I'm just going to scroll down quickly in case there's anything else that you want to utilize here. Okay, that's going to be our video. Let's click on upload. And once it is done, we will move on to the next step. All right, so here we are. That probably took around a minute, maybe a little bit more. And I'm sure if you've already gone through it, it's going to automatically generate captions for you, which is fantastic. So from here, what we can do is look at the themes. This is going to be the first step. We have our style, we have our captions, we have our B-rolls and a description in case you want to utilize that as well. So themes are going to be pretty much what your text looks like. So this is like the Alex Hormozy one. I do know this is Mr. Beast and a few others. There's another Hormozy one. Uh, but anyway, let's click on this. And what that means is that when the text actually comes up, it's going to showcase that. I'm just going to click on captions just to show you here. So if you'll notice, that's what it's going to look like. So if you go back to style and you wanted to change that, we could just now click on it. And it's probably better that you go to a specific point in the video because in the beginning, usually nothing is said, you know, unless you just start right away. But, you know, some of these look good. Some of these look better. Really up to you. I think they all look great. The Mr. Beast, right? That looks very familiar. There's also the ability to change it and make the position. So with that 50 now, depending on where you want to put it, you know, 50 looks fine, maybe a little bit under me. Perfect. And if you want to make it bigger, we can do that right now. So it's going to just kind of like go down ever so slightly. I think that looks fine exactly how it is. It also has the main color, the second color, and the third color. That's going to be self-explanatory. If you want to mess around with that, you just click on it and change it. But I'm not going to go too deep into that because that's based upon your preferences. Just like that, it auto creates all the captions. So let's go take a look at them. So there are going to be times where they might be a little off, you know. So if I had to build my online business from square one, all from scratch, I would do the same exact thing that I am right now, posting quality content that my audience is looking for. It's a great way to do it, especially when it comes to social media platforms. There are so many on there, on there, online, maybe you could ch change that, right? It doesn't take all that long to do. And in the process, it's quite fun if you ask me. So that looks good in terms of the captions. You can just quickly go through and make sure that they are correct. What you can also do is if you go here, you can obviously change this around in case you want to move this, add words, change it around the color. So let's say we wanted to do yellow. Once again, we can do green up to you. You can also edit it too. So like if this was say spelled wrong, you can just go in, type it in and change it. From what I've seen in my demoing so far, it, it looks pretty accurate from the captions that come in. So that's gonna be the captions aspect. Next we have B-roll. So if you see something where maybe you wanna use a different video or maybe like there's a part of your video where you're like closing your eyes too much or you just look funny, you know, you can change it around so that you can find a video that matches something that's spoken right here. So right here, especially when it comes to social media platforms. So we can click on this, we can do search B-roll and we can just do social, let's do social media and let's load more. We we're talking about creating videos. So something like this would work. Let's click on this and we can do apply. So what happens now is that this is actually going to replace me. Oops, cancel, clicked off there and apply. So we can start here. Let's see if the volume is a little down so it doesn't talk over me too much. And I'm just going to play from here and you're going to notice it could say it's a great way to do it. And then it's going to go to this video and it's going to have me over it. How cool is that, right? And we can do that throughout pretty much everything. So it's quite fun if you ask me. So let's just click on fun. We can search gifts or B-rolls. Once again, B-roll, fun, you know, probably with like, let's say online business success, maybe something like that. Anytime you're doing this, think of keywords that could be related to it. I'll probably just go with like success or maybe something like this. Looks like people are having fun. Search. One more. Probably won't spend too much time, but this person looks like they're having fun there. Let's do apply, cancel. Let's just play it from there. 
Okay, there we go. There's some B-rolls. And last but not least, we have our description. So generating your description with AI, really, I mean, if you want to use that, that's going to be up to you. It's just another <laughs> faster way of getting your video done. Like if you're posting it on Instagram or TikTok, wherever it's going to be, this is something that you can obviously just go in and utilize. At the end of the day, of course, you can save it right here. Project save. And if you want to get it, we just simply click on export and they will email you when your video is ready. Okay, and once that is finished, all you need to do is simply check your download folder and that's where you can get your video when it's finally done. So, so that's my sub magic tutorial. There's not a whole lot to explain and that's a really good thing. That means a lot of people can just go in there and pretty much get their captions done, change them around, edit the styles, maybe add some B-rolls and just simply export your video and you'll be good to go. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. I also do have my link as well as my coupon should you want to upgrade and get a nice little discount. That coupon code is going to be ISLAND. I-S-L-A-N-D. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.